Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Lisa and this is gonna be a, a quick video. I just wanted to kind of jump on here real quick and um, talk about the, uh, the Peace Out Acne Dots. So they are little like flesh colored, I'm doing this one handed so bear with me. They're little flesh colored little patches that you put on your um, big pimples that you get like these. That I have popping up and it's supposed to pull the crap out overnight you put them on overnight and or you're supposed to wear them for at least like four to six hours anyway I wear them overnight and it helps pull the crud out of it and um, then you don't have to be squeezing or popping so I've already washed my face um, and used my toner which um, lately I have been using um, the old Henriksen uh, it's the glow 2 uh, dark spot toner. I got this from Influencer, um, complimentary for testing purposes, and so far I like it. I've been using it for a couple weeks. I've seen a little bit of a difference so far, um, but anyway, that's not what this video is about. So anyway, so here are the patches. I've used them a couple times, as you can tell. They come, I think like 10 or 12, 10 dots in one of these little containers, and I can't remember if what box comes with 10 or 20. Um, but I get them from Sephora. I've tried other dots and they just don't do what these do. So um, let's go ahead and come to the bathroom here. And yeah. So we're gonna put these on. So literally I just take this, one side sticky and one side is not, I don't know how that's gonna focus. Anyway, you just put them right on where the your troubled spot is. Where'd it go? There it goes. So I got three of them. And one more here. Hmm. Usually once I put them on, they're on. I usually don't move them, but I'm gonna move that one a little bit. So you typically wanna put these on after you wash your face um, and maybe tone it, I, us I usually put them on before I do the toner. Definitely before I do any other kinds of like serums um, or creams or whatever. And I just kind of try to avoid this area if I can help it or go in between just around it. Um, otherwise, it doesn't want to stick to your skin. I will check in again with you guys in the morning and so you can see what this all pulls out. Okay, so I've had these things on for about three hours. I woke up in the middle of the night because um, my daughter's alarm went off. Um, let's see if I can get you in a little bit. So you can see that they've already pulled out some stuff. So um, we'll call this a three hour check in. We'll see what it looks like in a couple more hours. All right, so these things have been on for about, oh, six, seven hours. So as you can see, they've got stuff that has come out of them. So this is what it looks like after you take it off. So you can see all the pus kind of went up in there. Let me get another ones. There's three of them. So now you can hear my daughter watching TV in the background, The Little Mermaid. There's the other one. It wasn't a lot out of there than what I, more, less out there than what I expected. So here's what it looks like after. Right now they are pretty smooth, except for maybe this one. So Tonight I'll probably put them on again and that should totally get rid of it, but they are a little sticky, but it definitely has helped. So, peace out acne dots, magic or hocus pocus? I would go with magic most of the time. Sometimes it takes a couple nights, sometimes just one night is good enough if it's not that big, but these are pretty big, so it's going to take probably another night or two. So I hope that helps, and if you ever decide on buying them, um, I definitely think they are worth the money. Um, so 
I will see you in my next video. Have a good day. Bye.